All right, next one. It's really funny because whenever I bring this one up, it makes me laugh. Because when my friends, when I talk to my friends and stuff on the phone or when they get a hold of me, they're always innocent. Always innocent. They didn't do nothing wrong when they get a speeding ticket, traffic ticket, you know, whenever some emergency situation happens, it's never their fault. Or they're being singled out. However, when I talked to somebody about this and I was like, now what if you were to be pulled over today and you could just basically, you know, push a button on your phone hand the phone out of the window to the officer that's pulling you over, somebody comes to your house in emergency, you know, but you have a lawyer on call for all emergency situations and you're not paying that, meaning you don't have to worry about it costing you anything. Or if you had an app on your phone that the second you get pulled over, you push the app, you, you pay for the app right then and there, you know, less than a dollar a day. And now all of a sudden you have legal representation right there on the spot that'll also go into court for you to basically get like a speeding ticket, traffic ticket, parking ticket, stuff like that off your bill. And the reason why I, I kind of always find this funny is because when people are telling me, you know, they're all honorable and they're all, you know, oh, I, I would, you know, I would never, okay. However, when they get the ticket, nobody ever seems to be guilty of getting a ticket, which is kind of funny to me however if it didn't cost you anything and you basically pushed a button on your phone and you handed the phone out to one of the officer now the officer could look at it and be like okay you need to slow down this is just a warning okay so what if that officer then goes and gives you a ticket and all you had to do is before you even put the keys back in the ignition all you had to do is take a picture front back push send officer goes away you go about your business what what would that do we'll say in about six or eight hours business hours say the next business day you're going to get a call from a law firm saying okay mr such and such uh, we are now handling your ticket this is what's going on we're going to go in court on this particular day and you only have to go in if the judge wants you there now guilty or not remember that your insurance goes up which means for the next three to six years three to five years in some cases you're going to be paying more so if you decide to say well i was guilty i'm going to go ahead and pay instead of fighting it to get it moved to a non-moving violation or maybe even go in and have it made up for uh you gotta learn to shut the door tight <laughs> my daughter can't shut the door tight. so in other words you uh go in there you don't want a hundred dollar ticket turning out to be a thousand dollar ticket over time because people are like oh i'll just you know i'm guilty that's fine but what if you go to a class okay instead of having to pay the higher insurance fees and everything you may be guilty that's fine but what if you, there's other ways around it other than it going on your insurance going on your record that may or may not go away after a period of time so what would that be worth to you you know, having, what if you go into the hospital and you need a lawyer? What if the cops show up at your house to take your kids away or something and you need to get Department of Family Child Services, okay? What would that be worth to you to have a lawyer talk to them and DCFS talk to your, um, to the police officers? What would that be worth? You know, a lot of people, they don't know, but what if you had a lawyer in your pocket for all emergency situations, Okay and say 24 hours a day, seven days a week, you know you're gonna have a lawyer answer the phone, you know that no matter if it's a holiday or anything else, you're gonna be able to pick up the phone for all emergencies. My daughter's right outside here, she doesn't realize she's not going down very far. Anyway, I gotta get back to my daughter. I'm just asking, what would that be worth to you? Anyway, talk to you guys soon.